everybody. Okay, let's give this circuit a try. So the strategy here is we're going to try and figure out V1 and V2, but only using the voltage divider equation as our strategy, as opposed to other techniques, which we'll learn more later. So just using the voltage divider, but I'm just going to draw this with a different geometry. So maybe it's easier to recognize what's happening. So here's the three volt and then here's the 90 ohm resistor. And then see this node right here. I'll call that node A and I'll just write right here. And it kind of splits into this and this. So it kind of goes this branch over here. So there's that 150 and the 75 in parallel. And then the 40 ohm resistor. And then this branch over here, there's the 60 and then the 30. Okay, so, and then let me label this further. So I'll call this node B, which is right here. And then I'll call this node C, which is right here. And the bottom over here I'll call node D, which is over here. Okay, so it's... If we... Let, let's simplify this further. See between node A and D? It'd be good if we could figure out what's happening. So it's, let's go step by step first. Okay, what's this in parallel? 1 over 150, 1 over 75, which is 2 over 150. So that's 3 over 150, and then take the reciprocal. So that's 50. Right? And then and let me just redraw these. Okay, so 50 and 40 in series is 90, 60 and 30 in series is 90, so 90 and 90 in parallel is 45. So it's like 90, 45, and then let me draw the notes. This is A. Right, this is way down. This is D. This was C, and this was B. Right, and then here, this is A, and this is D. Right, here to here is here to here. Now, if you look at this circuit, you could tell me the voltage here. Right, it's three volts times ninety over the sum 90 plus 45, which is 135, right? And then the voltage from here to here is three volts times 45 over 135. Okay, so, so this is one volt, this is two volts, right? So here to here, two volts, here to here, one volt. Let me do that again. Here to here, two volts. Here to here, one volt. Okay, but we're after the voltage here between A and B, which is right here. We need this voltage right here. That's V1. Okay, and then A to D, we just said is one volt. Right here to here is one volt. So if you take a look at it, oh, let me draw it like this. Like here's A, here's D, and there is 50, 40. And we already know this is one volt. From A to D is one volt. So from here to here, 
here to here is 1 volt times 50 over 50 plus 40. Here to here is 1 volt times 40 over 50 plus 40. Right, so here to here is 5 ninths of a volt. Here to here is 4 ninths. So that's, we, we got our answer right here, 5 ninths. That's V1. And then, what's the other one? V2. Okay, and then we want the voltage right here. And then again, A to D, let me draw it over here. Here's A, here's D. And we got the 60 ohm, 30 ohm. We just said, right, here to A to D, here to here is one volt. Here to here is one volt. So if you only want the voltage here, it's one volt times 60 over 60 plus 30. If you want the voltage from here to here, it's one volt times 30 over 60 plus 30. All right, so the voltage over here is two thirds. The voltage here is one third. So that's it right here, one third. So that's the answer. Five ninths over here, one third over here. Okay, I hope that helps. So keep studying and I'll see you on the next video.